Alright, welcome back to my Let's Play of Gene Forge 1, here on my channel Idol Wisdom. We're picking up here again in Drake's Vale, where we met Rockus the Drake. And, I don't know, we paid him, <laughs> we paid him off to not be hostile, but you know, whatever. And then we also paid the servile Helm, learned Helm, to teach us more about leadership. And he did, although it was, I think, a little too expensive, but you know, whatever. But I guess Vodius is like... Learn maybe hopefully he's learned a lesson about not being a, a chump, but I don't know. There's a lot of cryo drakes there, so we didn't want to be, you know, fighting them. So we're gonna continue heading west and see if we can't get to this ancient crypt. But I seem to recall this being a difficult area, so we'll see. This pylon is carved with many intricate inscriptions and drawings. You think the designs are sketches of the figures buried here when they were alive and the funerals of the deceased fascinating stuff for anthropologists but not for you i don't know surprisingly some of these holy offerings are still intact wow that's cool let's not you know but you know touch them now let's see if we can't okay whoever the people were who lived here before the shapers came you are starting to develop some respect for them. This huge vault is an impressive piece of architecture, all the more so be for being so old. The walls are covered with inscriptions. Even if you understood the writing, the entries are too old to be legible. Still, the length of the listings indicate a long history and complicated language. However, as, you, as interested as you are by the ancient history here, contemporary additions seem much more relevant to your efforts. Someone has recently placed numerous mines here, there are also a host of tur ugh, turrets and, detec and detection crystals. These shapings are not, are not sloppy. They are carefully and elegantly made. Clearly the work of the, the result of recent work by a highly skilled shaper. This can't be the work of one of the outsiders. The sensors of the mines are not currently moving. They aren't currently primed to explode. But that could change in a moment, though. Oh. <laughs> Oh, blew up the turret too. I, I should have. That was foolish of me. Let's try that. Let's just pretend that didn't happen. Let's try that again. Yes, yes. Okay. You, get over here. Alright, let's actually do it this way. No, no, no. Yes, you. No, no, no. No. Yep, yep. Amazing. So much respect. Let's see if I can't dodge this whole no, no, this way. Ooh, I think we might got it. I think we might got it. Oh, I think I might be dead. I'm dead. Oh, wait, no. Ah. I think we might have it. <laughs> this is, you know, super action-y gameplay. Let's see what happens if I stay right here. Will I blow up? Sometimes combat mode is the best way to get anything done. Especially with the, the speed spell. As a your as the wind beneath your wings. As they say. If they do still say that. Us. Mm-hmm. That's Move down here. 
Da, 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 da. Da. You get over here. My goodness, there's a lot of these dang things. Oh my goodness! I think, you know, obviously Gesh made these, but he's thorough. Too bad he didn't count on someone as super thorough as me. Okay, let's actually hit the speed spell again. It's sort of winding down. Where's he saw? Oh yeah. <laughs> or undoing his great work, <laughs> his excellent work. Oh, geez. What sort of turret is this? A Reaper turret. Now, we saw it earlier. Oh, geez, I forgot one right over there. I'm gonna get myself killed. That Reaper turrets. I think it said, as far as Avodius knows. He never even saw or heard of a Reaper turret before, so it was something new here in Su that was developed apparently in Sushu Island. But we're going to find later games that Reaper turrets are quite common. Maybe they were adapted for one of the secrets of Sushu Island that gets out. Although, of course, they're not really one of the super problematic secrets. That's the... Oh my goodness, dude! How many of these things are there? Oh, there's an, oh geez, there's another one right over there. <laughs> this is... I, I know you come here for super action-y gameplay. And that is, of course, what I'm giving you. It's the, you know, idle wisdom difference. <laughs> Let's see. Can I get this one? Oh, I hope. Yes, I can. I hope. Hope I didn't just get killed. All right. Nope. I got it. I got it. Good grief, dude. You managed to short out the crystal. I am kind of irritated. I don't get any experience for this. All this hard work I'm doing, being really annoying, <laughs> and I don't get any experience. Come on now. Let's see, anything else? Oh, of course there is. Of course there is. Let's actually do that. Oh, I just gave speed to the Reaper turret. That's, that's great. Bam, citizen. I hopefully don't encounter something terrible over here. I should probably bring my creations. Yep, some of the offerings are still good. Or still intact, anyways. We're not going to steal any of the money that's on the floor. That's actually very no way no. That's impious in a fairly high order and just rude. As we know, you must never be rude. Being rude is being weak. Good life advice from Morgan Le Fay from that old TV movie of Merlin, which was actually a pretty good movie. What was her name? Oh, what's her name? The actress that plays Morgan Le Fay. Uh, oh, Helena Bonham Carter. She does a really good job. That was a pretty good movie, generally, I, I thought. For, especially for a TV movie. Sam Neill? Yeah. Or was Merlin? I liked it. Rooker Hauer as Vortigern. And other people, I can't remember their names as other people. <laughs> Obviously. Okay, here's another one. Anyone? Anyone? Bueller? Bueller? Okay. 
Okay. And... I still don't think it's everybody. Okay, let's actually save right quick. Save. Now, everybody, get over here. Since I don't want Avodius by himself when we finally get through this labyrinth of mines. Not really a labyrinth, gauntlet of mines and turrets. Okay, four, aka Avodius. No, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, come on, Avodius, quit wasting your turns. Oh my goodness gracious, dude. I would congratulate Gash for his efforts, except for the fact that he's not loyal at all. He's not doing the Shaper's work here. He's just, you know, grabbing his own power. You may say, well, what good is doing the Shaper's work? Well, despite their bad attitude, Shapers have a pretty interesting goal, which we'll hear more about in the next game. I do find it kind of interesting. Ooh, there's a ring back here. What is it? Oh, come on. That's insulting. <laughs> Can't get there from where you are. Oh no, that's that's the real sad. Come on, Avodius, get your behind in gear. Okay, what's down? You see a restless ghost in the quarter ahead, standing at attention. It seems to be standing watch over something. It doesn't seem to notice you for the moment. Oh jeez, get out. Okay. Everybody? Everybody? No, no, everybody. Everybody. Yeah, or whatever Backstreet Boys say, I don't know. Backstreet, back, all right. <laughs> I mean, were they gone ever? I didn't know they were gone. Uh-oh. Ow! Oh, jeez! He almost killed poor little claw bug. Get him. Get him. That was terrible. Crypt Guardian. Well... Okay, we need to, let's do this, and... Okay, you, get back. You just come back here. And guard at Bodius. Nice. Very good. Haha! -ha! 60! Ooh, geez, there's more. <laughs> Y'all remember Woody Woodpecker? Did you ever see like reruns of that? I saw reruns of it. I guess it was reruns. I don't even know what. There were all the cartoons when I was a kid, except oh no, not all of them. So many of the cartoons when I was a kid were just reruns. Really boring. There was good ones. No, there was new ones too. But a lot of them were just reruns of old, stupid, boring car com cartoons. The ones I couldn't, st I, I really couldn't stand, like the Flintstones and the Jetsons. They're so boring. Woody Woodpecker was kind of boring, but sometimes funny. I used to like Chili Willy the Penguin. Oh, Jesus, another one. I didn't even see it. Uh-oh, I think we're, oh, we're, we're, we're up a creek. Without a paddle. Up a creek with no paddle. My poor imitation of Cypress Hill, or impression of Cypress Hill. Do you like Cypress Hill? I used to like Cypress Hill back when I was younger. Put away, <laughs> put away my artillery and got me a Glock. No, put away my Blish. It got me a Glock. 
took a little trip to the funky shaping spot. He tried to jack me in the shower, I got shot. La 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 la. <laughs> or something along those lines. Haha! <laughs> -ha. Okay, where are you? You go get him. Very good. Good B. Kill. Even though that bee's actually a scorpion. Uh oh. Uh, you did you ran out of action once, didn't you? That's right, Pally. Yeah, if you can hit him enough, especially with certain sorts of attacks, you can take away all their action points, which is really helpful. I imagine there's more, but let's save, actually, since we did pretty well. We did pretty well. Got through all those dang turrets. Fighting a bunch of shades. Anything here? Yep, yep. Funerals, funerals, and funerals. Alright, well. I guess it's what, you, it's what you could expect in a ancient crypt. Ow. You dung beetle. Take a look over here. Let's see. Heal five. Heal one. Heal two. Nope, nothing. All right, cool. That's cool. Nothing, nothing. More nothing. Lots and lots of nothing. My favorite thing in the world. Nothing. Uh oh. Get him. There's more down here. And well, let's do this first. Haha. -ha. Yeah, yeah. All right. That was well done. Ooh, I think there might be. Let's just take a peek. Nobody. All right. Cool. Woohoo! Nobody. Fascinating stuff for anthropologists, but you know, not for old dumb dumb anti-intellectual Livodius. Let's save again. I'm gonna actually check out that sarcophagus. I think the word sarcophagus means like doesn't it mean like flesh eater? Ooh, gemstones. Thank you. And bones. We'll leave the bones there. Don't disturb the bones of the dead. You observe the letter of the law, if not the spirit. Yep, yep, yep. Alright, yep, yep. Oh man, Vodius, get some education. Vodius doesn't care. It's like, I don't care. Oh jeez, poor claw bug. Poor claw bug. Ah, uh, come on. Let's do this. Okay, you, get him. Get him. Oh, come on. I don't think he's going to be able to get him. Oh, nope, nope. Darn it. 
Oh, you you screwed up, Dad. You could have killed one of the car bugs, and you, you blew it. You blew your chance. I mean, not that I'm sad about that. Clawbugs are like, hey, I thought you're on our side. I'm like, sorry, Clawbugs, I I am on your side. You know, you know me. I'm a Bodius. I'm on your side. Shapers protecting you. What we get? The girdle of leadership. Oh my goodness! Look at that thing. Two to leadership. One to intelligence and four to armor. Oh my goodness, that is amazing. And a cloak, yeah, who cares? What are we wearing? The student's belt, one to intelligence and one damaging level in combat. Yeah, that's nothing for, for, especially for this build compared to this girdle of leadership. Let's take a look at our situation now. We're making decent experience here. Our leadership is now 13. That's really cool. Nice. Alright, cool. Excellent. Excellente. Excellente toss. <laughs> this is a... Yep, okay. Dumb old Evodius. Dumb, dumb Evodius. Oh, blind Bodius doesn't want to learn how to read. Rut row. This is a general sort of crypt where the bones of less impressive dead were stacked over many years. There are long lists of names in the walls, soul records of the countless souls interred here. An icy breeze strikes you as you stand at the entrance. There is a hostile presence ahead. You can feel it. There is also a strong breeze blowing through these tunnels. It picks up a lot of dust, and it's not easy to see. Oh jeez, wow. Okay. Here they come. Here they come. Two marks and two ten. Oh, whatever. I don't know. Lame Star Wars reference. Uh-oh. Don't. Don't you dare. Are these weaker ones? Oh, Waste Ghost. These are weaker ones, not the Crypt Guardians. Huh. Well, we're doing this, this place kind of backwards, I guess. Hmm. Oh, good job there, Evodius. What the heck was that? Evodius did a little dance. <laughs> what a dummy. Let's actually use a an, an essence pod. Oh, that didn't do barely anything. That was, that's, oh my goodness, these are weak. Jeez. I think in Gene Forge 2, the essence pods do more for you, but I could be wrong about that. And these things are pathetic. They're not even a good resource, really. They're useful, sort of. Oh, jeez. We're being <laughs> tailed. Yeah? Following. Oh, ow. Uh, what are you doing, dude? Ow, don't hit my blish. Good shot. Let's actually do this. So everyone can actually hit their targets. Can you actually... No, no, you can't do nothing, can you? I can't do nothing. Oh, of course that one goes first. Oh my goodness, everyone is a dumb dumb. Is everybody dumb? Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna keep you right here so you don't attack they don't attack a Vodius. Well done. Uh, let's actually heal six. Where is that other ghost? Did it go away? I miss a run off. Sometimes they just go run around on their little, I don't know, you know, they're running around and they don't see you quite. There's another one. Maybe that's the same one. Haha, you missed. What an idiot. 
Good job. Well done. Oh, there's a... Oh, I bet you that's a Spectre robe. Those sell for a fair bit of money. And we need money. Yep. Because the Vodius was being a big spender. He was like, you know, making it rain over there. <laughs> What's this? Oh, let's leave it. Okay, this is an ancient stone pillar, far older than anything that Shaper's built here. It has a healthy layer of mold and dust, which fills this crypt. You notice that one part of the pillar has been worn smooth. There are also carvings on the pillar. Some of them depict crude humanoid figures, all in a long line, touching the pillar as they walk past. Let's touch it. Nothing. You don't feel anything special. It's like one of those pillars that you have to touch them all. I don't. I think there might be a certain order you have to do it in. I can't remember. I don't even remember what it does, to be honest. Maybe I'll check it out. If I can find, figure it out, I'll, I'll do it. So you guys can see it. I know you're waiting with bated breath. You're waiting with bated breath. You're like, oh please, I just want to see the Gene Forge 1 Susha Island smooth pillar touching ceremony. <laughs> I mean, I know I am, but you know. I say it's a bit weird that you want to see that too. You guys are a bunch of freaks. But that's good. If you're watching my videos at all, I'm happy. If you like my videos at all, I'm happy. If you like Gene Forge at all, I, I think that's cool. You should play it and tell your friends about it. I really think it's a great series. Oh geez, we're being followed by a mob of ghosts. I watched a really interesting video of like a, it was at GDC, I, I don't know, I think Game Developers Conference or some crap like that. Anyways, and the guest speaker of this, that the one I saw was of course Jeff Vogel, who is the guy who does Spiderweb software games, these games. And um, his interview was, his, his speech or whatever you want to call it, was really interesting and it's like, it was really cool. I, I think he gave good advice, had good insight. And it was interesting. Let's kill this one. Oh, we missed. Oh, I blew it. I blew it. Blew it. Man, these, cry these cryos are hitting hard. Oh, geez, Louise, what is this? Waste ghost, huh? Yeah, whatever. Good job. Get him. Well done. That's why I like my waste ghost. Well done. Don't be giving me no medium rare waste ghosts. <laughs> okay. Seven. And six. Get healed. What's in here? Nothing. Tools of the trade, but not my trade. The Vodius is not a mason. Neither of the buildy crafty type, nor of the weird secret society type. Oh no. Um, that's no good. Oh! Eh. Eh. What are you? There's a Reaper turret right there. That's, that's great. Okay, we're gonna do this the hard way. Actually, I want you to see what's over here. Now, you go right there, out of range. Okay, can you come through? You cannot. No, 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 okay. You, okay, I, I screwed this up, but you know, whatever. We lost a freaking claw bug. That's terrible. Okay, let's, four, no, let's do this, oh, let's see. Oh, I, I screwed up again. I screwed up again. I tried, I did all that careful work and I screwed it up. Can't believe I just did this. Son of a gun. 
It's a hundred and one. Hmm. I may just die here. <laughs> oh, geez. No, I think we're good. Uh, well, that was terrible. <laughs> Poor claw bugs. Yeah, whatever. I don't care. I hate you guys. What should we do? I'm going to think. You know what I think? I think we need to, what's it call it? We need to smurf the heck out of here. Let's try to get out of here. We'll have to come back again and finish this level. This is a tough area. And I screwed up royally. I should have only lost one claw bug there and I lost two. And I think we got all the ghosts in this area, but Oh wait, did we check this room? Yes, okay, then that there's nothing here. Oh jeez. Well, Ancient Crypt is a dangerous place. I wonder if that... No, that was Shaper Gash's um, contribution. That was not the Ancients there. Nope. Gash, you owe me two claw bugs! Of course, he'd probably say I owe him a bunch of warning crystals, but, you know, whatever. Let's go back here. And then we're going to go through here. We just tell the stupid Gamma Greeters, lead on, yes, yes. I don't care, dude. Go away. And then we have to tell another one. Yes, yes. Lead on. Blah, blah, blah. No, I'm not following you. I hate you. I don't actually hate you. Hopefully I don't have to kill you, you stupid battle game. But yeah, I may. Alright, cool. Here we are. Oh, poor claw bugs. They died so easily to those reaper turrets. Those were not weak claw bugs either. Jeez. Uh, I mean, I Hold on to that. Let's put the student's belt down. Alright, cool. Alright, well, I guess I'm going to have to think about what to do. We're going to go back there again and finish that level next episode. So thank you for joining me this time on this episode of my Let's Play of Geneforge 1 here on my channel, Idle Wisdom. Take care, y'all.